city is covered in snow tonight Where did my love go? Santa, I'm waiting for him but he's not Hey you guys, welcome back for yet another cozy kind of get it all done Christmas style Today we're going to be doing a ton, we're going to be making some beef stew some Christmas cupcakes to put inside of the cake stand. We got some new decor. Um, I told you guys I got a new throw to add some red into the living room. I got a new doormat from Target. And then I also got this beautiful red Tis the Season to be Jolly sign. But I don't know if it's going to arrive in time for this video. If it does, I'll cut it in here somewhere. I'm hoping that it gets here before when I'm planning to upload this video. But we got that and then we're also going to be wrapping some gifts you guys so I'm so excited to just bring all this coziness into your home. This was a super cozy day for us and it was just so Christmassy and, and happy and jolly and I'm very excited to be sharing this with you guys. But after this video we will be taking a break. Um, if you follow me on Instagram then you already know we officially started like building our closet maids um, and getting organized and build furniture for the rest of the house now that the main floor is kind of situated now. So. We're going to go ahead and jump into making the beef stew, but first I did want to mention that today's video is a collab with my good friend Bella over from At Home with Bella. And guys, this was one of my very first YouTube friends, I guess you can say, when I first started YouTube. And over time, we have just become so close. She is so sweet and has such a good good golden heart and I love her channel she has a ton of motivation a ton of cleaning motivation a ton of Christmas motivation right now so after watching this video I would love it if you guys would stop on by to her channel I'll link her channel and her video down in the description and now back to the beef stew I just chopped up some potatoes and baby carrots to add to it um, this is not gonna be an in-depth recipe because I'm pretty sure every culture has some version of beef stew I'm just sharing kind of the Puerto Rican way if you guys don't know I am Puerto Rican and um, my husband is Jamaican and this is his favorite dish because in his culture they have something very very similar to it so now I'm just adding about a pound of that beef and I'm gonna season it with a very Spanish Puerto Rican like seasoning um, called sazon and adobo which is basically just all-purpose seasoning my pressure cooker is already preheated as well because I do brown my meat for about 20 minutes before I actually put everything else in and set it to pressure cook so and I'm also mixing it like every now and then so while I'm doing that I'm also simultaneously trying to start on the cupcakes now this is not gonna be anything crazy um, if you watch my first Christmas decorate with me I did put a, and don't quote me on, I do not know how to say this correctly, a pan, panatone, um, the fruit cake inside of the cake stand, but that's all finished. So now I just feel like it's empty and I want something Christmassy inside. So I'm just using some Betty Crocker spice mix and following the directions on the box, but I am gonna make these cupcakes nice and Christmassy. So it's true. I'm so glad you feel it too. Nothing to us. All right, y'all, now that the beef is nice and brown, I'm going to go ahead and add my potatoes and baby carrots. I use baby carrots, but you can use regular carrots. I just didn't feel like doing all of that peeling, but this is a very easy alternative, and they come out so good and so soft. So I added one can of tomato sauce, and then I did fill it up with water two times and added that to the stew, and also one spoon of tomato paste. But guys, the secret ingredient in this beef stew is something called sofrito. If you're Spanish, then and you already know about this but if you do not know about this guys it is the secret ingredient to like all Spanish cooking and they do sell it at the store you may have seen it there's, there's like a red one and a green one but this is homemade sofrito my mom buys it off of some lady um, in her neighborhood that makes it and sells it and if you can do the same I would suggest that because it's so much better than a store-bought one It's basically just a mix of green peppers and onions and garlic and I it's just it's just heaven in a bottle let's just put it that way <laughs> and then I added also some chicken bouillon you can use beef but I use chicken and then some bay Leaves, and I like to go a little heavy on the bay leaves because I just feel like they give um, the stew so much flavor and then I'm going to go ahead and set this to pressure cook on high for 40 minutes. Christmas time's got the best of me, then it starts. 
to snow in our heart We both know that we're falling in love Alright y'all, now back to the cupcakes. I'm just going to go ahead and fill my Christmas liners with the mix. And I did get these liners from Target. It was like the last one y'all and I could not even believe it. Christmas is selling out so quick this year and I'm here for it y'all. I'm not mad. Um, everybody needs some Christmas cheer in their lives and I'm one of those. So, And now I just want to introduce myself if this is your first time here or first time clicking on one of my videos first. Thank you so much for doing that. I am so happy that you're here. My name is Josie and I'm a wife and a first time mom to an almost one year old baby girl. And on my channel, I do a ton of homemaking, cleaning, motivation, cooking, decor, and lately a lot of Christmas content, obviously. But that is about to slow down a bit, not end, but slow down a bit now that most of the house is decorated because we just moved into this house and before Christmas started and this whole wave of Christmas started I was taking you guys along the process of building furniture getting situated into the house so the next couple videos are gonna be more about um, just organizing we're installing our closet maids into our closets because if you watch the empty house tour none of our closets have any systems within them which was kind of a downer but also um, a project for us so I'm kind of happy we get to customize it exactly the way we like it and then also my daughter's first birthday is coming up within the next week or two so we're going to be putting out um, a decorate with me for her winter wonderland birthday and I'm excited for that so I would really love if you guys would stick around hit that red subscribe button and if you enjoyed today's video also give that a like it helps my channel a ton and I'm really trying to make it to 3,000 subscribers by the end of this Christmas season so if you would do that and help me get to that, that would mean so much to me. And here I'm just going to be coloring my frosting for the cupcakes that I am going to be piping on. And I did buy store bought frosting. So what I'm doing is adding confectioner sugar and that is a hack. If you're going to be piping um, store bought frosting because it's a little more runny and not as easy to pipe on than if you make it yourself. But if you go ahead and add um, confectioner sugar one tablespoon at a time to your desired um, thickness or till it reaches a stiff uh, a stiff peak what am I saying <laughs> a stiff peak then it is way easier to pipe so that's what I'm doing and then I was coloring one red or attempted to color one red and one green but the red came out more pink I guess this type of frosting I mean this type of food coloring that I use it's like a gel it doesn't do like deep colors they're more of like a pastel color so I ended up just using the green frosting for the cupcakes that I was gonna display and then I just put the pink ones um, in the fridge for the ones that we were gonna eat we're gonna dance, 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 have a good time Dance, 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 all night long We're gonna dance, 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 and have a good time I think Santa's gonna come and join us in this song oh, yeah. So tall, and I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. The snow is falling down, and the storm is on its way. But as long as you're around, everything will be okay. Cause all I want. Holiday with you tomorrow. It is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin. 
Well, I did my best with the frosting. I did use the wrong tip. I wanted the larger star tip and I chose the smaller one, but we're not even gonna worry about it because we're gonna dress these cupcakes up with some Christmas sprinkles from Target and these little um, frosting candies from Target. They're like little penguins, gingerbread cookies, trees, and all these Christmas um, objects. And I'm just gonna put them on the cupcakes and not even worry about my frosting. <laughs> so then after that, I went ahead and put it in the fridge for the frosting to get cool and harden a bit while I clean the kitchen and clean all this mess that I made. To say that my love for you is true. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. Cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else. I've decorated everything till we perfect for this week. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else. I've decorated everything till we perfect for this week. Tomorrow. Christmas memories I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep Yeah, I spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday so because the beef stew is not done yet and the cupcakes are cooling, I'm going to go ahead and add the bit of decor that I got from Target. I'm adding this Threshold Christmas rug that I bought from Target. It was really inexpensive, like $12 or $15, $12 to $15 in that range. And I absolutely love it. It just added some more red to the first floor and if you guys know from my first Christmas clean and decorate with me I've been struggling to add red because I tried to go neutral at first and I was like oh no honey I need some more red in here <laughs> so then I'm also adding um, a red throw to the couch a lot of you guys said add red pillows but I didn't want to do that but I did want to add red to the couch and I was looking for a specific throw I wanted this chunky knit throw with the pom-poms at the end but I could only find it in other colors other than red but Target finally put out their good Christmas decor my Target took out forever to put out all the magnolia and um all the just all the good Christmas decor so I found this at Target when I went and I got it along with the rug and I was just like so happy to get it and I think it just added so much red into the living room like I've been trying to do and it makes the couch look so much more cozy and I went ahead and added my cream um, throw that I had on the couch into the blanket basket just so that we have another throw to kind of get cozy when we're watching movies or anything like that. It's just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how so above the couch where I have that kind of um, neutral Christmas sign from Hobby Lobby, that is what I'm going to replace with the Tis the Season to Be Jolly sign that's in red that I ordered but it didn't come in time and then I'm going to put that other um, sign somewhere else, try to repurpose it somewhere else in the house. But now that the beef stew is done, I'm just going to be showing you guys that and the cupcakes guys. Any type of beef stew is paired so, so nicely with white rice and it's such a treat. I obviously cannot make this all the time because beef is not the healthiest meat to eat all the time, but when I do, it is such a treat and we really enjoyed it. Don't even care what we do if I spend it with you. It's 
just gonna be you and me Christmas memories. Now, you guys did comment down in my comment section when I asked what type of videos you guys wanted to see this Christmas season, and you guys did say that you wanted to do kind of a, a wrap with me. And I tried, y'all, but my toddler, or almost toddler, was not letting me do it. So I had to move on to the island. That big one is actually her birthday gift. That's why it's white and silver, because I'm doing a winter wonderland theme, guys. Stay tuned for that video. I am so, so excited to decorate. I've got everything ready, and her dress and her tiara it's just so adorable so just stay tuned for that but yeah we're just gonna wrap these gifts and then make some hot cocoa and end this video y'all but thank you guys so much for tuning in yet again if you made it this far i appreciate it if you like the video please go ahead and give it a like and if you're not already hit that red subscribe button so that you don't miss any of the future content that i have i have a lot of exciting things coming you guys with this new home and just all <laughs> look at her passing through there with a piece of the paper she she's just too much y'all but yeah guys i'll see you guys in my next video and Make sure that your notification bell is turned on so you don't miss any of the future content coming up. Love you guys. Bye. So blessed that I can be with you. Cause God knows that I've been longing for you. I just want to hold you close. You know the stars are shining just for you. Let's take a walk and we can follow the moon. Let's till we reach a place we can stay. Maybe kiss a bit and dream away. And in a while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy mm -mm, It's a beautiful kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you Kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you And in a while we're gonna go inside And drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you let me give you a Christmas a moment we'll fill with love and joy Love and so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you With you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you With you mm -hmm. So beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you Cry